Darwin cab drivers and locals have vented their frustration at the cycle taxis known as pedicabs. But they'll have to get used to them. The Darwin City Council says they're here to stay. Lucy McNally reports. Hi. Hey. You're free? Yeah, yeah, come on, get in. Driven by backpackers and loved by tourists, 10 pedicabs have been operating around Darwin CBD this dry season. They're advertised as a fun green way to get around the city. I think it's a good thing to have a competition against the taxis and I think it's a fun thing, for example, for tourists. Taxi drivers are less than impressed and they say it's got nothing to do with losing money. Well, most of the drivers, they don't like them. Not only the taxi, not only the taxi drivers. All the car drivers also, they don't like them because they're disturbing the traffic. Some locals agree. But they're just everywhere. They don't look. Most of them are used to driving on the other side of the road because they're all internationals. I'm all for internationals working here, but it is very annoying having them here. No, I think they're pretty cool, but also I think they're a pain in the, bit, pain in the ass a little bit. But locals aren't grumbling to the right people. Darwin City Council says it's only had two complaints, which it's passed on to the pedicab operator. One was in relation to the noise from the radios um, on the pedicabs um, and he's undertaken to ensure that uh, noise levels are reduced. Issues from members of the public, other drivers, you know, if they've got issues like that they need to raise it with us, uh, with council. The pedicab company pays $16 a week to council for temporary permits, but the council says a trial period is over and the low number of complaints means it can issue permanent permits, which means more power to the pedals. Lucy McNally, ABC News.